the section 32, the auction itself with your bidding, and obviously at the end if you're successful with the signing of contracts and putting up of the sold sticker. Um, as I said before, my name's Courtney Matthews in the crowd. I have a number of people, Jay's up the back, Abby and Claire in the middle, Kai here as well, Michelle is somewhere as well. Again, if you have any questions in relation to the auction or the terms here today, then flag down those team members and they'll have that conversation with you shortly. The property is selling, as I said, via auction. So the format for today is I'll read through the contract, the key terms of the contract that I need to make mention of. I'll talk through the rules for today's auction. I'll talk a bit about the home and the opportunity that is before you here today. And then from that point forward, I'll open up and I'll call for your competitive bidding. The property is known in the contract as lot number 42 on plan of subdivision 034506. In certificate of title, volume 8164, folio 688, but in plain English, it's 19 Meadow Crescent, Mount Waverley, is what we're selling here today. Today's sale does include all the fixtures and fittings, everything that is stuck is staying with the home. That includes window furnishings, fixed floor coverings, electrical light fittings, they all form part of the contract here today. We are selling via a public auction, whereby 10% deposit is required upon the signing of the contract, unless we've made specific terms with you before today's auction that it might include a small deposit here today of the balance that would happen on monday and if we've had any other terms outside of what i've just suggested then we'll honor those terms that we've had with you settlement as well preferred settlement 60 to 90 days again same thing so i lost my paper we will honor those settlement terms that we have pre-arranged with you if we have any other pre-arranged settlement terms but 60 or 90 is the preference here today in terms of settlement again in questions in relation to that Please raise your hand or have one of my staff members raise the question to them so they can confer with the owners if you have anything outside of those terms that I've just mentioned just now. The rules for today's auction, the auction will be conducted in accordance with the rules and any additional conditions that were made available before the start of today's auction. The auction rules prevent an auctioneer from accepting bids or offers for the property after the property has been knocked down to the successful bidder. The vendors do have a reserve price and as the auctioneer will indicate bidders on request and the law prohibits false bids, major disruptions by bidders and bidders preventing others from bidding and provides fines for such conduct. The rules today do permit vendor bids and the words during the auction are used to make a bid on the half of the vendor are vendor bid and by law only I as the auctioneer can make a vendor bid. Pretty straightforward with the rules. Again, if you have any questions, raise your hand and one of our staff members will attend to you shortly. Well, ladies and gentlemen, before we get underway, I want to talk to you about the home and the opportunity here before you. There are rare opportunities that come up in suburban Melbourne and Mount Waverley, and this happens to be one of them, sitting on just over a thousand square metres of land, a thousand and eighteen square metres of approximate land, is this fantastic home that, as I've said in the video and I've said many times before, reminds me that you're travelling into country Victoria for a holiday home visit because you just can escape here. And to live in the suburbs, to live in the Glen Waverley Secondary School Zone, to have the Pinewood Primary Zone, and to have the Monash Freeway nearby, Pinewood Shops, the Glen Shopping Centre, Mount Waverley Village, Chadston 15 minutes down the road. You're in the centre point of the southeast in terms of amenities, in terms of schooling, but you're on a thousand odd square metres that just feels like home. It feels like some way a home away from home. If you want to keep the home, ladies and gentlemen, you've got that option. If you want to extend and renovate, you've got the option. If you want to knock down and build a large luxury home, you've got the option because you've got the land and the scope to do it. If you want to develop, you've got the option as well, subject of course to council approvals as well, but you've got the option. So you've got all those multitude of choices on a large allotment in the best school zones in the area with some of the best amenities within arm's reach. And that's what you're buying here today. We've been in a pretty solid and strong market as well, buyers and bidders. And my suggestion is to bid and bid strong if you've come here to buy because A, opportunities and land like this don't come up quite often. And obviously as the market continues to increase, that could be another concern to buyers having to pay more down the track. So bidders and buyers, you're gonna to need to bid strong for this four bedroom, one bathroom home, beautiful long driveway, double lock up garage, 1,018 approximate square meters. And as I mentioned, one of the best locations in the Southeast. Bidders and buyers, I throw it over to you now for a fair and reasonable start. You can start me where you like, but I just have one final rule. How I sell here today, I call three times, first call, Second call, third and final call, and when the hammer hits the contract, like so, the property is sold. I cannot take a bid or offer after that takes place. Make sure you've made your final decision to raise your hand and call that bid before I do that. Now over to you, bidders and buyers. A fair, reasonable start's what I look for. I'm in your hands now. Call it where you see it to get us underway. 19 Meadow Crescent, Mount Waverley, bidders and buyers. In your hands from here. 
Take it straight up to 1.7 if you want to be strong with your bids here today. Otherwise, I'll take a quarter of that. I'll take that $20,000, $25,000 rise from here as well. $1,650,000 for the bid, six seventy dollars or better the bid I'll take from here. At $1,650,000 is the bid here. At $1,650,000, now six seventy dollars or better from here if you wish. At $1,650,000 is the bid. Welcoming also and mentioning our online bidders today as well have the same opportunity. Kai will represent and call out their bids online as well. At $1,650,000 is the bid. On my left hand side, bidders and buyers need to bid to put yourself in front here today. At $1,650,000 is the bid. A strong start, no less. At $650,000 is the bid. $670,000. $675,000 is the bid. The quarter bid I asked for. Six one seven's the bid straight back on a quick fast bid at one million seven hundred's the bid. At one million seven hundred now back to our starting bidder at one seven's the bid there on my left hand side. At one million seven hundred thousand now on my left hand side, she's in front at this stage at one seven. Against all bidders parties here today, at one million seven hundred thousand is the bid on my back left here now. Bidders and buyers need to get involved. One seven fifty. One seven five zero is the bid, one million seven hundred and fifty thousand. Good strong bid back now against you, man. A strong bid on and the like is probably the way to go. At seven fifty is the bid now. At one million seven fifty is the bid up the back. One point seven six. One point seven six a ten thousand dollar rise there, Jay. Seven sixty is the bid now. Just the two of you in it at the moment, fifty fifty chance, a good place to be. One seven eighty. One seven eighty a strong bid back at one seven eight. One million seven eighty is the bid. 178 is the bid. Do we go to 18 and round it up now? 178. 1.8, a good strong bid back now. 18. 820 is the bid on the market selling plane for keeps. 820 is the bid here. I'll mention it again, but 820 is the bid. At 1,820,000. As I said before, we are selling here now on the market selling. 820 is the bid. 1.85 is the bid here on my left hand side, and 850 is the bid now. Two of you have been in it all the way, and 850 is the bid. At 1,850,000 is the bid. At 1,850,000. 1.9 is the bid, a good strong bid back. 1.9, just the two of you still in it. 1.9 is the bid. Where do we go from here? Even a 10, even a 5, I'd say. Can't get a block like it anywhere else. 1.9 there in front, they take it otherwise. 1,000. 1,000, of course. 1.901. 9.01. Are you sure? Not for 1,000. 1.901. I'll give you time to think. At 1,901,000 is the bid. 9,10. Good strong bid back. Does the test your resolve? Are we still on or out? 9,10. Give you time to consult and decide as we sell away here otherwise at 9,10 is the bid. 9,011. 9,20. 9,20. 1,920,000. At 1,920,000. Are you sure? I'll come back in a moment because you said no to me earlier. 1920 is the bid. Talk to Claire further. All other parties be known. We sell away here now. 1,920,000 the bid. If there's no better bid on that third final call, the hammer goes down. I sell. Make it crystal clear. At 1,920,000. I get ready to call three times to sell. Bidders and buyers, make sure you've made your final decisions. At 1,920,000. I look to my back left to see are we in or out. Checking. 921. 921. 926. 926. 926. 926. 1 million 926. At 1,926,000. I'll let you consult a moment or two further, but at 1,926,000 is the bid here. 1.93. 1.93. 9.30 is the bid, 9.30 is the bid, Jay. 9.36. At 1 million, 9.36. At 1 million, 9.36, I get ready to sell away if there's no better bid, need to be sure. At 1 million, 9.36. I'll give a moment or so, I know it's a big decision. I don't have another property or block like it. At 1 million, 9.36, what do we do? 
We're about at 940. Call it your best or your last if you wish. 100%. Sure. I'll come back one last time. Hey, 1,936,000. I sell away if there's no better bid now. Calling three times. Give you a final moment to decide and jump in before the end. First time of the call now at 1,936,000. So we're selling. Second call. At 1,936,000. And we sell away no better bid. Third and final call. All done. Finished. Silent. Selling. Selling. 1,000. 937. 937. 1,937. 1,940. There's the 4,0940. The round-up bid. 1,940. 1,940. 1,940. Another consult, it seems. You've been back in a couple of times. I've got a triple check with you, I realise. Had 1,940,000. Here's the bid. Quick family discussion underway as I give everyone enough time because it is a big deal for everyone. At 1,940,000 before I sell, though, I need to know now. 940 is the bid. I get ready to call three times. Fair warning now that I sell away if I hear nothing from over here. First time of the call now at 1,940,000. 1.95. 10,000 rise, J950. 960. 960 back at you. 960 is the bid. 196. 196. 1,960,000 is the bid. Just checking again now. 1,960,000 in front at the top of the driveway. They're buying if there's no better bid. 1,960,000 now. Need to know. Good, fast, strong bidding's been the way here today at 1,960,000 is the bid. You said that last time. At 1,960,000 now, I call three times. Fair warning again, I sell here, no better bid. At 1,960,000. First time of the call. Second time of the call. Third and final time. Selling. Selling. Need to know, need to know now. 980. 1,980,000, Jay. 990. 990. 990. Surrender. You said out, you said surrender. I'll double check again. At 1,990, again I called three times to sell, got to double check now. First time of the call now at 990. 1,990, the bid. Second call, had 1,990,000 the bid. Third and final call. Are we done? Finished, silent, sell it up the top. Had 1,990,000, we are selling. Selling. And we are, Claire, we are sold. Congratulations to our purchaser at the top of the driveway. 1,990,000 the final price there. Thank you in attending another A-Wide auction. Have a fantastic weekend.